and we're back. This is the day before. What do they mean by the day before? Well, that uh, Olympics sort of thing is coming soon. The athletic festival, that's what they call it. Remember that way back at the beginning? This is for the, the, the super rich hotel for folks from faraway places. They spend tons of money. <laughs> this is a hotel? This is a hotel? You've got a rope for an antenna, a block house that you can walk in and out of, there's absolutely no doors. This hotel is horrible. They should get their money back, and there's Miss Hint. <laughs> okay, you gotta break your way through there. It's freezing here, and it's not rich either. I can't sleep in the snow. I'll get the owner. Yeah! You go. You go, girlfriend. <laughs> No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's freezing. Have I been tricked? But I paid a lot of money. I better check it out. Yep, everyone's hating it. Don't cry, kids. There's no bathroom or doors. It's horrible. I want to be fun. Oh, wait. Oh, sorry, kids. Sorry, kids. Not mean to do that. <laughs> but they're already crying anyway, so it doesn't matter. This weather is torture. I'm always doomed to suffer. I'll make the owner suffer. Hey, go get him. There you go. <laughs> you all go get him. You too. This guy up top is training for the 100 meter dash. You want to race him? Okay, you run on the lower lane. I'll tell. I'll say when to start. So I say go. Stay at the red pole. This is a practice. Set. Go! 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 Boost! 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 boost. Yeah! I won. <laughs> this these classes are practicing skipping rope. Hey, didn't know that there was no skipping rope event this year. Wow, a thorn rope skipping comp? Oh my god, that sure is one motivated rope, I gotta tell you. If there was electrified, or electrified rope, that would work pretty well too. Well, here's the great festival. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the world's greatest athletic festival of the year. And that's in quotes, in case you don't see. <laughs> I'm Tack Glancer, the host of this year's first. Thank you, thank you. Okay, everyone quiet down now, please. Thank you. Okay, come on. Shut up! Shut up! Okay. Alright, is everyone split into two teams? Yup, the red and white teams. The team with the highest score wins, of course. And we have a lovely prize. Professor Theo! He has many uses. Punching bag, doorstop, paperweight, answering machine, etc, etc. <laughs> yeah, in case you can't tell, you're uh professor is kind of the prize. What? What's going on here? I don't think anyone will be happy with this prize. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm with Marina on that one. <laughs> you have to keep getting him back when he gets kidnapped, just like Princess Peach. Hey, what do we have here? It's me, the hospital doctor. Don't you remember me? Yeah, if you don't remember, it's from uh, one way back in 1-2. Oh, I have some sad news. Do you remember Joel from Nepton? Well, he passed away a few days ago. Yeah, it's sad. Say, are you going to the fest? If so, why don't you join us? White team is weak this year, and we could use your help. Let's see. Okay, here's the deal. If white team wins, I want the prize. So she, even she's getting, she's entering the festival for the professor. This is kind of silly. She should just go in the background and just get him back. She has the power. She's more powerful than these dang clancers. You want that? I didn't think anyone wanted it. Fine. If he wins, if we win, he's yours. Huh? I thought you guys wanted a prize for the fest. <laughs> Marina's got a point there. Ha! Nobody wants a prize. We like the fest. But there are weird, weird folks who like prizes. Um, actually, a prize isn't that bad, but the professor over there, he's not really that good of a prize. And why is that guy sweating? Oh, Theo, you're great. <laughs> And that's the end of the level. Now we're going to go to the festival. There's a whole bunch of events to do here, and I'm going to go through them one by one. The day of. This is the festival. We got a whole bunch of events. 100 meter dash, 200 and 400. They're all basically the same, but the 100 is obviously the hardest because you have the least amount of time to recover your... Uh, how should I put it? Um... Because it's almost impossible to get the perfect start like the rest of the Clancers. So you have to regain your time that you lost. And that's hardest to do on the 100 meter dash. But it's still not all that hard to do if you just start boosting with the control pad as soon as it says go. Rad Racer! Oh wait, that's not the, that's not the line. <laughs> No, I'm just kidding. 
You know what I meant. And yeah. If you didn't get the, uh, if you don't have fast enough hand speed, this would be kind of a uh, kind of a hard time. You could use the C buttons, but they're not as fast as using the D-pad. You could even just put one hand on one side and then, uh, you know, your strongest hand, strongest button pressing hand to that side of the controller and just mash the button. Yeah, same rules, same thing for the 200 and 400 meter dashes. I don't even know why I'm showing them honestly because they're all the exact same and that is one huge chick in the front. <laughs> Yes, that is a girl, because you can see the bow on the hat. Ah! Oh, and don't go too early, otherwise it'll be a false start and you'll get penalized for that. Well, not exactly penalized, but you'll get, um, you only get three tries to do it. Oops, my finger slipped off the button. So, yeah, just go after it says go. You have plenty of recovery time, as you can see here, because the Clancers really are quite slow. But then again, you are a super-powered robot. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Winner goes to Marina Light Years. All you have to do really is win most of the events. Uh, so if you win, uh, what is it, 4 out of 7 I think it is, or is it 5 out of 8? Uh, how many events were there? I, for I forgot to count them. Uh, yeah, 4 out of 7 will do just fine in getting yourself to the uh, um, winner ceremony, so to speak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this is an even longer dash. It's 400 meters, which is double the last one. Just as easy because, I mean, I should say just as boring because it's easy. There is just absolutely no competition whatsoever. You just blow past them in the first 20 meters and then you never see them again. All you got is the repeating audience and the background and it is pretty slow. Well, actually, it doesn't seem that slow as you can see by the uh, thing at the bottom right corner, but it feels a lot slower because of how many times you have to press the dang button and I'm switching hands. <laughs> yes, I have my right hand on the left D-pad <laughs> right now. <laughs> Just to save my hands a little bit of torment from this event. And we're nearly done with the 400 meter dash. And yeah, 20 more to go. Cramping. Okay, we made it. Where's the other guys? They are nowhere in sight, nor we will even see them in this ceremony until after. I mean, we won't even see them finish until the ceremony. And yeah. <laughs> That's pretty much all you can do for those uh, dashes, so to speak. There's nothing to them, it's just keep pressing them. <laughs> and the jump, that is basically... Um, oh, oh, it's the slide jump. Oh, wait, I should probably do this in the next part. I'll see you guys then.